mechanical and aerospace engineering is one of the oldest department in the IIT Hyderabad. We started in the year 2008 along with the inception of IIT Hyderabad. We are also very unique uh, in the IIT ecosystem since both mechanical and aerospace engineering are operating under one umbrella. The aerospace team was started as a fourth team in the department in 2014, primarily to leverage the location of IIT Hyderabad near the defense labs and the aerospace companies in the Telangana hub. So the idea is to support these labs in developing technology for next generation aircrafts, space technology and missile application. The department hosts state-of-the-art facilities like wind tunnel lab, flight mechanics lab, composite fabrication facilities and aerodynamics lab to carry out state-of-the-art research. Our curriculum caters to the industrial requirement and it gets constantly revamped, taking their feedback and suggestions. And also it caters to the technological advancements which are happening of late. Design specialization is existing from the inception of mechanical and aerospace engineering department. Later, this specialization name changed to mechanics and design. This specialization encompasses the study of principles and applications of mechanics and dynamics, which is essential for the design, analysis, and development of mechanical systems. IIT Hyderabad provides the state-of-art facilities and workshops to conduct the research in mechanics and dynamics subjects. civilization started when humans came to know how to create fire and utilize it for their daily activities. And this is the space where uh, TFE stream fits in. The thermofluid engineering or the TFE stream uh, within mechanical engineering is one of the oldest and a very important branch. Faculty associated with the TFE stream uh, work on a broad spectrum of research topics uh, ranging from very fundamental uh, problems like bubble dynamics, uh, low Reynolds number flow, to more uh, applied topics like fluid dynamics of uh, wind turbines, uh, combustion of new and novel fuels. Currently, we are offering a bachelor's program in mechanical engineering, as well as four master's program. At undergraduate level, we are a participating department in bachelors in computation engineering as well as bachelors in engineering sciences program. Also, we offer minors in aerospace engineering. We are coordinating department for two masters program, integrated sensors and systems and electrical vehicle. We are participating department in the interdisciplinary masters program such as atomic engineering, integrated circuits and microprocessor packaging, polymers and biosystems engineering, smart mobility and um, integrated computational materials engineering. Also, we are offering a master's program in computation mechanics, especially catering to working professionals in the industry during the evening hours, being an online program. The, if you look at it, actually most real-world problems uh, are a combination of both design and manufacturing. So with that intent in mind, we started a master's program, what we call as uh, integrated design and manufacturing. In this, the student is expected to go through regular manufacturing courses like uh, additive manufacturing, metal forming, welding, etc. And in addition to it, he or she is also doing courses like FEM, CFT, etc. And the practical curriculum we have facilitates uh, such an integrated approach uh, in a easy and a convenient manner. And I think with that, the student will be exposed to both the design tools as well as the manufacturing or the real world understanding. Our department comprises of 34 faculty members and 11 staff members. 
and close to 200 plus PTEC students, 85 master students and 85 plus PhD scholars. We have close to 30 plus labs in our department catering to both fundamental uh, teaching as well as uh, research requirements. Our colleagues are a mix of old and young researchers, uh, creating a vibrant ecosystem. We have a unique opportunity in creating a department that helps in capacity building and doing cutting edge research for the growth of India and its defense. You need students to carry out research. And the Department of Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering ensures that the younger colleagues who have joined very recently, they get PhD students to carry forward that research work. So we have amazing lines of faculties who are very young and their average is around almost 35 years. That makes a good composition of best student and teacher learning. And as well as we have a great student to teacher ratio. And the best part is whenever the faculties visit to our labs, so they will always uh, give some inputs about how can we improve our research how can we improve our experiments and analysis so their knowledge is not only limited to their groups but it is also for the other students as well. Despite being a pretty new uh, institute, the amount of facilities we have over here are comparatively quite good when it comes to uh, performing metal additive manufacturing along with uh, the mechanical characterization. This is the only place we will get the combination of mechanical aerospace in a single department. So whenever you are doing the research, you can find the applicability directly on this. I would like to add my expertise, whatever I have, to the expertise already present in the department. Uh, I can take forward to the department to a better uh, level. I see that as IIT Hyderabad grows, the Department of Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering will also grow. Along with us growing, we should also make sure that the ecosystem around us benefits from it and also grows along with us. It should be a symbiotic growth. Our vision is to become a department of repute that is sought after by prospective students faculty members and industry collaborators. We invite you all to be part of our continued success and growth.